Hi everyone. It's um, let me let me just say what an honour and a privilege it is to be here first and foremost. And you know what? It really, really is because on my on my journey, I've really learned that this is a collective. You know, it's all about us. And um, you know, I've been sitting there and I've been thinking about so many succinct messages I've heard that have gone in. I thought, wow, you know, I really that really resonates with me. One was um, the founders where they said, look. You know, to propagate peace outwards, we must first find the peace inwards. I mean, that's been so true of my journey um, of transformation. You know, and I'm sure all of us here, because life throws many, many challenges at, here, at us. I mean, this is my understanding of this is, it, you know, it is not to hinder us in our progress, but to enable us to learn the lessons faster. And that is always um, outward facing. But, um, you know, when the, when the founders said that, that is so, so true. Because in a sense, I mean, certainly, certainly for me on my journey, I had to go through the darkness to get to the light. You know, when I think of that, I think it's true of many of us. You know, we come into this world and we fall down and we get up. We, we learn, we fall down, we get up. Sometimes we can go around in circles and we find it hard to learn you know and i've also learned it is about development you know the development of a person and i've learned to judge uh, not judge but assess a person on their development not what fancy school they've gone to how, what they have um what accolades they may have got you know none of this stuff you know and that is uh, always in the actions and there's always fused with consistency it's so you know, this is the thing. So, you know, I've also realized that as a filmmaker, you know, I am a filmmaker, I have wrote many documentaries and every story is unbelievably unique and interesting as you unravel the onion as it may be. You know, well, one place that I start is when you go into the, the depth of a person where that pain, that um, them challenges, that learning really is. This is where I always really find the uniqueness of that person. And from that point, I really go there. That's a really, really interesting fact. I'll go through many doors from that point to unravel what this person is really about. And that is true of all of us. Because the truth is that the further we can reach in is the further that we can reach out. And it's an inside job, really, you know. So it's so very well said by the founders of this organisation, which is, do so much wonderful work. It's, you know, it starts inside and then it's that developmental journey to... And then we can position ourselves and invite good people, places and things that can move this message forward. So one of the things I suppose is... um. I went to prison for a long time. Yes, you know, I made bad choices. Um, there's been a lot of media engagement about my journey. Um, well, I say it how it is because, you know, I am accountable for my actions, but I'm also accountable for, for finding the courage to change them and go forward. So, you know, this is, you know, this is the truth. And there is a great providence of, you know, the work that I have done now, you know, for many years. So other people can judge that. Who am I to judge that? But, it, but it's there. So that was a fact. And, um, but we've gone on, you know, and we've, I've just, I've, me, but I've just put one foot in front of the other, really, in the right direction. And I've always been open to learn and be guided and instructed by the right people. Because my way didn't work. So I went to someone whose way was really work. And I still do this today. The people are much, more further along than me. So this is a great thing. Margaret, Robin, some, you know, there were some wonderful people in this room who, by their actions, do so much wonderful work. These are the people, all the people in this room who I'm, who I'm talking about. And, you know, when that comes together cohesively and is directed in the right way, it's unbelievably powerful. You know, and this is the, this is the thing. So with Margaret, what we've done, I, I, there's, a lot of media engagement now on my life journey, and that's for another fact, is I, um, where I was 
I went to prison for a long time, and that story, I was quite senior, unfortunately, in the mistakes that I made. But I now am uh, involved in a new initiative, which is called Two Extremes. Now, this is with a, an unbelievable character who was called Cal Mahay. He's an ex-gold police commander. He was one of the highest-ranking police officers in this country. He's Asian. You know, he went through many... Um, challenges. Uh, you know, he come from the bottom all the way to boardroom level in the police force in Derbyshire. You know, he faced uh, racism, bullying, all these kind of institutional things that are hidden. But he then left the police force um, thinking he could do better. And he actually wanted to go back to the police force to improve things that he thought could be improved. He, yeah, you know, he's now an international, very successful leadership coach. He's a public speaking coach. He goes into corporate companies and he, and he actually now goes into many, many police forces and trains all the management, all the up and coming uh, senior officers on leadership. So he's doing wonderful work. But together, we have banded together and it's called Two Extremes because I want to draw, uh, get you to imagine this because this is a really important point that two people, human beings who picked different roads and was really driven in the roads that they took. You could say that went from the bottom all the way through this, this journey, but two souls who could not be more at more opposite ends of the spectrum, really. It, you, you could not be further apart. But the, the interesting fact is that after an internal journey of discovery by both of us in that metamorphosis, which was a 360, when we met a couple of years ago at an event, we, I mean, me, certainly, I, I just knew, I, you know, I have this sometimes, I knew there was something about this, this person where he would be part of my journey and I would be part of his. I didn't know what, what that would be at that point. But we've gone on to do much, much work and... Um, so now, one of the messages that we do together, we launched Two Extremes. We do that together. It's gaining unbelievable media attention. It was in the Telegraph last week. There's a film in production on our story. We've been in advanced negotiations with uh, TV, radio, about different stuff. I'll just say this, because this helps to empower what we're doing. Not because what will be will be, but the work, the work of it is the the message that we want to put out is that when we met, although we would have been a